In 2017, studies revealed that other meteorites in our solar system contain a different radioactive signature, a rare isotope of aluminum called aluminum-26. That's a rather odd atom that is not formed very easily in supernovas. So, where did it actually come from? Well answer will also reveal the birth of our sun. There is a rare type of giant star 40 to 50 times the mass of our sun called the Wolfrayet star. Wolfrayet stars burn the hottest of all stars and producing heavy elements like aluminum, 26. These are massive and so hot that they blow off a tremendous wind. This stellar wind ejects tons of matter from the star into the surrounding space and creating a beautiful bubble structure. The walls or shell of the bubble are so dense and full of matter and heavy elements. The stellar wind pushes more and more matter into the shell until this material collapses under its own gravity and condenses into stars. Maybe that's what happened to our solar system about 4 billion years ago. If our solar system formed within a Wolfrayet bubble nebula, it would explain why so much aluminum, 26 is present in meteorites. Wait, that's not all, the big story is still out there. What we do know is that our story began with the collapse of the solar nebula, but one day our sun will turn into a stunning nebula too. Well how? That's the story of another video. Well if you love the video, be sure to subscribe for the next.